hey hi guys welcome to the channel in this video i will show you how you can get values from users or can put values through the terminal in your program here i wanted to you know enter dynamic value in this row is variable but whenever i try to enter a value it says read only editor so in this case what i have to do i have to run my code in terminal not in output so now i will show you how you can do that it's really easy first of all uh, make sure you have installed code runner extension in your visual studio okay and after that just simply go to file and then go to the preferences and go to setting and here search for code runner terminal here you can see i got this code runner run in terminal option you just need to check this one just check mark this here we go that's all we have to do and close this and now you have to close your visual studio and you have to restart it that's all you have to do and after this in terminal go to the folder where you have saved your file in my case it's in f drive so i will just say f and cd c toots in this folder this file is stored stored now i will just simply click on this run code option or control alt n and there you can see it started running now okay i got the error there is some kind of error uh, one more time okay so it says um, there is no file like this so what i simply do i once again i go to f and then press column i'm basically going back to that drive and now i'm in that particular drive okay and now i will click on run and it must work now and there you can see i'm able to enter rows i will just type 8 and enter and now the program is working so this is how you do it it's really easy thank you so much for watching please like share and subscribe and if you're still getting any error you can tell me in the comment sections and please watch video twice if you don't understand just make sure you check mark that terminal option in your uh, settings and after that make sure whenever you run your program you you are in that particular drive where you have stored it that's all you have to do. Thanks so much. Bye.